Let's see how to solve nice cubic equation. By integer zero theorem, we know it does not have rational solutions. But using computer algebra system like Maple, we can figure out its real but approximate solutions. It turns out x equals negative 1.8 a 0.35 and 1.52. So you see these solutions are between negative 2 and 2, right? Can we find its exact solutions? Yes. Today I will show you a nice method use sine functions. We know sine t is between negative one and one, right? So two sine t is between negative two and two. So we can let x ask two sine t. So let x equals two sine t, and we can find t to be between negative pi, half pi to half pi to make the function one to one. Now plug in. So we get two sine t q minus v, two sine t plus one equals zero. So we get eight sine t q minus six sine t plus one equals zero. At this point, we can use the well-known identity. It is sine three t equals three sine t minus four sine t q. So we can change left side as negative two, three sine t, right? And then this term, so minus four sine t cubed plus one equals zero. So this part is exactly sine three t. So we get negative two sine three t. I move the negative uh, one to the right side. So we get negative one. So sine three t equals one over two. And because t is between negative half pi to half pi, so three t is between negative three pi over two and three pi over two. Now let's solve this equation. Create a coordinate system. We know sine pi over six is half, right? So pi over six, and also sine pi pi over six is half. We also need to consider negative angle. Start from here, clockwise to this part would be negative pi, and add negative pi over six, so we get negative seven pi over six. So sine negative seven pi over six also half. So we get three solutions. So t equals pi over six, pi pi over six, and negative seven pi over six. Dividing three, so we get t equals pi over 18, five pi over 18, and negative seven pi over 18. So the exact solutions to the given equation would be x equals two sine t plug in. So we get two sine pi over 18 
2 sin 5 pi over 18 and negative 2 sin 7 pi over 18. If you like this video, please subscribe. Thank you.